Ready, aim, fire! Hey, what's up guys, Multibullet here, and I'm going to be doing another quick tutorial on how to install the Life in the Woods mod pack. And it's actually, oh whoops, you didn't see that, um, it's actually pretty easy as long as you follow the steps pretty well. So these two pages, the links will be in the description. So first you want to install Forge and um, do not get the latest 1.7.10 or the latest one. You want to get the 1.6.4 because that's what Life in the Woods is for. Not, I don't think all the mods are updated or whatever. So the just go right here 1.6.4 latest or if that's not there then you can just scroll all the way down and it'll be down here okay so do not do not get universal you're supposed to get installer now so just click installer bring you to adfly you wait the five seconds I don't want my download right there I want this download okay keep and then go ahead and throw it on your desktop or whatever you want to do. Go ahead and exit out of that. Okay, and then you right click because you're not supposed to open with four or you're not supposed to open with WinRAR. Well, I, I guess you can do that another way, but this is just a much easier. So just right click it, open with, and then the Java Platform SE binary. Right, and then it will bring up this little screen. If it doesn't, then you do not install the installer one because that's what happened to me I accidentally got the universal so make sure you get the installer one okay install client if you're playing alone or server so yeah so client okay the download and that says successfully complete so go ahead and run minecraft and wait for it to load Play. and find the profile under forge and then play so it can load forge and all all the stuff so I I think if you don't load it and then you put in the mods it kind of messes it up so okay so I'll, we only got those right now so now go ahead and do the Windows plus R or for Windows 7 there's just the button right there and you can put in what I'm about to put in. So to go to your dot Minecraft, do percent app or yeah, percent app data percent and press OK. Bring up all your stuff, go to dot Minecraft, and then go to your mods folder. And then here's what we'll pause. Go back to the Life in the Woods page. And you can either download the basic or the hungry. The hungry includes one additional mod that makes the game more difficult, more survival centric, and makes food and hunger management more important. So I downloaded the hungry, and turns out, um, every food available only restores one hunger bar. So yeah, we'll just download the basic for now. Go ahead and click that, and then go ahead and download. Wait the seconds for takes a download okay and then throw it in oh no no shh go ahead and exit out of that once you throw it on your desktop or whatever you want to do okay open it you don't need to open with it's just open just click it as long as you have WinRAR if you don't that will be in the description also okay so now what you want to do is select all of it like all of it and just drag and drop into your mods folder and there you go that's pretty much it go ahead and run minecraft wait for it to load and then bam you have life in the woods and that's, that's how to install Life in the Woods mod pack. 
Let's see, did it work? It worked. Pretty sure. Yep. Make sure you go to your mods. There's all of them. Yep. Okay. Well, that's how to install Life in the Woods mod pack for Minecraft. One point, actually, no, 1.6.4, I guess you would say that, because the Life in the Woods mod pack is 1.6.4, but whatever. Um, so yeah, thanks guys for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to like the video if it helped you. Remember that? And yeah, so thanks guys for watching. And my phone just farted. And thanks for watching again. Okay, thanks for watching that again, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.